In the South Bay, rain has been falling steadily, and tonight San Jose police began evacuating people living along creeks and rivers. This comes after the city of San Jose declared a state of emergency because of possible flooding. KTVU South Bay reporter LaMonica Peters live now in San Jose near Coyote Creek tonight with more on the story. LaMonica. Fortunately, the rain has started to slow down here, but the winds are starting to pick up. Earlier today, we spoke with a woman who says she lives right along Coyote Creek, and she told us that they were aware of the mandatory evacuation, but a lot of people simply did not want to leave. But then the storm rolled in, bringing rain and wind, and that's when San Jose police stepped in. Most of the people said, no, I'm not going, I'm not going. And I was really hoping that they said, you have to go, and everybody had to go. Heavy rains and flooding are likely. If you are in the banks of the waterway, your life is in danger. You are ordered to evacuate from the creek immediately. After a mandatory evacuation order was issued by the city, San Jose police worked to get people living along the Coyote Creek to move to higher ground Wednesday night. The city of San Jose has issued a mandatory evacuation order. City officials don't know just how many people are living along rivers, creeks, and streams, but it could be in the thousands. Santa Clara County data shows that right now, about 10,000 people are unhoused in San Jose. Coyote Creek flooded back in February of 2017 after another atmospheric river storm. And this time, the city says it's prepared and will do whatever it can to keep people safe. We will continue to pursue notification and temporary replacement of those folks who are being asked to evacuate the waterways. Uh, moving individuals by force is our absolute last resort, and we will do it to ensure their safety, but also to ensure the safety of our public safety officers who may need to respond to emergency situations. Just before the storm moved in, one San Jose resident who lives near Coyote Creek expressed his concern about the homeless after seeing the devastation from 2017. It's pretty high right now. And if the storm that they say is going to come, this water is going to flood this whole area. Like this whole area last time in 2017, the water was up to here. You couldn't even walk around here. Because the city of San Jose declared a state of emergency, the city now has the power to evacuate and relocate unhoused people living along the waterways. The city and county say shelters and warming centers have expanded their capacity for emergency purposes, and transportation is being provided for people being evacuated. There have been about eight road closures throughout Santa Clara County this week, but San Jose's mayor says he's not expecting widespread flooding here. Now he says workers will continue to track water levels and that rescue teams are ready to go. Julie? Yeah, it's hard to forget what happened there in 2017. I'm just curious, the people who are homeless living in the tents there along the creek, are they, mandatory evacuations are in effect, are they going willingly or are many of them just wanting to stay put? Uh, at this point, they had no choice but to leave. Uh, once San Jose police saw that they were here, uh, there is a mandatory evacuation. It means that they have the authority to make them leave. And from what I understand, the city and the county have uh, expanded their shelter and warming centers uh, capacity during this emergency, and that's where they uh, will be taken. All right. LaMonica Peters reporting live tonight in San Jose. LaMonica, thank you.